Hi, in this tutorial, I will show you how to create an enterprise one page style in the designer pane and associate watchlist badges to individual tiles. The designer pane provides quick and easy access to frequently used components such as enterprise one applications, batch versions, tasks, watchlist items, ADF application tasks, and orchestrations and notifications. Two features enhance the capabilities of designer pane to add enterprise one pages as tiles and associating watchlist badges with individual tiles. The first feature enables you to easily access other enterprise one pages. Additionally, if you access an enterprise one page through the page tile, you can click the back button to return to a previous page or use the breadcrumb to access an enterprise one page in your navigation history. Another feature enables you to associate one or more watchlist badges in context with the tile on an enterprise one page. Watchlist badges can be associated with all tile types except watchlist. In this tutorial, let us consider a scenario in which an enterprise one page designer wants to link the shipment process flow with load building process and enable users to view count of shipments in various stages of shipment process flow. They simply have to create a page tile in the composed enterprise one page with the shipment process flow and associate the enterprise one page with the load building process with that tile. And to view count of shipments, they have to associate watchlist badges with individual tiles in the shipment process flow page. For this tutorial, let's assume that you already built a few composed pages with the tiles, lines and arrows representing a process flow. Now you want to link those pages together. First, let us see how to link the enterprise one pages. Navigate to the enterprise one page you created for the shipment process flow. On that enterprise one page, access the page composer from the login drop down menu, select manage content and then compose pages. Now let's see how to add a tile and include a link to an enterprise one page as a component. To add a tile, hover over any cell in the grid and click the add a tile icon. A tile is inserted automatically and the configure tile dialog appears. Select page as the tile type. From the page drop down menu, select the load building process page. Click OK in the configure tile dialog. Save and close the enterprise one page. On clicking the load building process page tile, the enterprise one page associated with the tile is open. In the load building process enterprise one page, click the back button to go back to the shipment process flow page. You can also use the breadcrumb to go to a page in your navigation history. Now let us see how to associate watchlist badges with tiles. For this tutorial, let's assume that you already created a watchlist to show the counts of shipment at status 10 in the shipment process flow page. Access the page composer from the login drop down menu. Select manage content and then compose pages. Hover over the tile for the shipment pending status. Click on the configure tile icon. The configure tile dialog appears. Enable the associate watchlist toggle button and the watchlist badge is displayed on the tile. Click OK in the configure tile dialog. Click the associate watchlist icon on the watchlist badge to access the associate watchlist pop-up window. Select the watchlist you created for the shipment pending status from the list of watchlists that are available to you. Click OK. The watchlist is associated with the tile and a flag icon is displayed on the watchlist badge. Save and close the page composer. Now let's see how a watchlist badge is displayed at runtime. The watchlist badges display a number that represent a count of record that meet the query criteria. The first time you open a composed enterprise one page with watchlist badges, enterprise one updates the watchlist badges with the most current information. The frequency of updates is determined by how the watchlists are defined. Hover over the watchlist badges to view the watchlist status and see how long it has been since its last update. Use the refresh icon in the tile to recompute watchlist information for the watchlist badges on a tile. When the watchlist is defined, a warning threshold and a critical threshold are specified. If a particular watchlist is within the threshold, the watchlist badges appear as blue badge. If a watchlist surpasses the warning threshold, the watchlist badges appear as orange badge. If it passes its critical threshold, the watchlist badges appear as red badge. Select the watchlist badge to open the related application where you can see the items included in the query. To remove a watchlist badge from a tile, access the page composer from the login drop down menu, select manage content, and then compose pages. Click the flag icon to access the associate watchlist pop up window. Click the delete button. Click OK. The watchlist badge is removed and the associate watchlist icon is displayed on the watchlist badge. Visit us online at learnjd.com. Thanks for watching.